I'm a local guy. I've lived in the Bayside area pretty much all my life. Um, grew up playing golf on all the sand belt courses around here. I've been coming down here to Sandy Range for you know, probably 15 years. Um, been having some lessons down here as well with Jonathan and uh, he said yeah, it'd probably be good to go and check out the guys and have a talk to them and um, so sort of came in here today uh, thinking I might get some minor performance gains but we've done a lot better than that, um, hugely better. I had a tendency to float my driver up into the air, um, too much spin rate you know, and you know, on a windy day, that's that's pretty tricky. You know, lose a lot of distance, and you know, of course, we all want distance. We tried a number of shafts, number of heads, and sort of brought it down to you know two or three. Um, some really interesting testing results, and then ended up making a decision on one because of the you know sort of dispersion pattern. We managed to clean up some aspects of my swing, like around swing path, uh, because we're on the track man here. You can sort of see those things and that gave me some great information about, you know, sort of how to get back on an inside swing path. I was slightly out. Um, and so that, that sort of combined with, uh, you know, the changes in the shaft flex and the, the different heads, um, I was picking up, you know, sort of 20, 25 yards. The nice thing here is that um, you guys, uh, I guess you could call it uh, your club agnostic. Um, you wouldn't have you know, a particular brand that you're trying to push. Um, it's just whatever's best for the golfer, which, which is great. I've had uh, various drivers over the years. Actually really liked the feel of tailor-made because I've got irons like that and we tested a whole bunch of tailor-mades and they felt really good. Um, there's some other ones we tried, but you know, that's where we ended up. That was a big surprise, having one shaft be so consistent. Um, you know, all of a sudden the dispersion uh, area dropped right back. Um, as Paul was saying, it looked like I could load up the shaft really nicely. And you know, that, that gave me you know, a bit more distance, but a ton more accuracy as well. This, this, um, this was a real, you know, sort of, it was quite enlightening about, you know, the process of custom club fitting. Um, I'd never, never done it before. You know, really, I would just go into a shop, maybe hit a few drivers, you know, they'd, they'd have a, a test facility there. And you go, yeah, that feels pretty good. A mate's told me about it. But there's no, you know, sort of real data that I was able to see. So this is much better and, you know, gave me a lot more confidence. And, then we went outside on the range. I just felt really comfortable with the club straight away. It was terrific. I absolutely recommend it. The, the ability to customise shaft, head, length of club. You get everything in a report and that tells you where you need to go. So yeah, I've got quite a few mates that uh, might be interested in the fact that I've picked up a fair bit of yardage and they'll want to know why.